Greetings and welcome to the introduction to physical science. In this video, we are going to look at the build a molecule simulator that we will be using for one of the labs in my physical science class. So if you come up to this screen, just go ahead and click on play to start the simulator. Or you might link in directly to the simulators here. And you'll see that we have three different things to have with building a molecule. We can build a single molecule, multiple molecules, or we can go to the playground and make even more complex molecules. So let's go ahead and get started with these. Let's look at the single molecules first. And it will have you collect, build certain collections of molecules. You have your molecules that are for the first set down here. So here you have hydrogen and oxygen. And here you have what you're trying to build. You're trying to build water, molecular oxygen, molecular hydrogen, carbon dioxide and nitrogen. Now you might notice looking at these that you only have hydrogen and oxygen here. And in fact, you only have one oxygen atom. So there's only a couple things that you can make with this first section, you could make water, and you can make molecular hydrogen. To get to the other ones, you have to use the little arrows down below to see the other sets of atoms. So here we can add more things. And here we can add nitrogen, and carbon so we'll be able to make all of those different atoms. So let's go ahead and go back and just look at the first one right here. And let's make a molecule of water. So all we need to do is to pull up the atoms place them on our screen. And we then have a molecule of water it highlights that letting you know that you've got one drag it there and you're done you've got the hydrogen you've collected a hydrogen atom. And you can do the same going through for the other ones. You can then make molecular oxygen and molecular hydrogen here. You can make carbon dioxide and molecular nitrogen here. And you will go ahead and finish your complete collection. Now you're going to do the same thing with the multiple molecules. So let's go ahead to multiples. And now you're going to be making two carbon dioxides, two of these, four of these, and three of these. So here, what can we make? Well, we can make an oxygen molecule there we've got one we can pull it in there and what else can we make well we can make a hydrogen molecule and we can put that in here so we're still needing more we only have one of each of those and again we have to go to the other sections of the simulator to make all of these up so here's some carbon and oxygen that we have we can make and some nitrogen we can use and here is some more hydrogen oxygen and nitrogen use all of those you can fill up your collection and go ahead and finish that up now the last thing is the playground so let's take a look at the playground that you want to look at and what we see here is now you've got various different atoms. You have hydrogen, oxygen, carbon, nitrogen, and chlorine. And again, there's several different things you can play with to try to put together various different atoms. So you can play with these a little bit and just build how complex of an atom can you make. And just add in various atoms. And you can have different things that will come from them. So we'll have different atoms. Now you'll note if you try to put one in there and there are no free electrons to do it, it simply will not let you add it. So we cannot add anything else to this atom unless we break the bond. We can snip the bond right there and put that hydrogen away. And maybe we want to try to bond something else there. Well, we can put a carbon atom there. And then maybe we can add another hydrogen to the carbon. So again, you can keep playing around with these and making different atoms. Now let's restart that because when you put things together, you can also see that you can make various different atoms if it's a molecules and it's a, it'll give you the actual names here as well. So if you want to make hydrogen cyanide, hydrogen, carbon and nitrogen put together will tell you what that atom is. If you want to make something like oxygen, we can take the oxygen up here and we have molecular oxygen. So you can play around with these and see how complex of a molecule you'll make. So for example, if we want to split some of these, let's go ahead and split a couple of these. We can see that carbon atoms like to bond together and we can make long strings of carbon atoms and put some hydrogen in there and we end up with some uh, various different molecules that we can make and you can make very complex molecules if you play around with this a little bit. Again, if you hit something with that's actually named in the simulator, it will show up there. Other ones uh, may not be stable or just may not have the names entered into the simulators.
So that concludes this discussion on the build a molecule simulator that we'll be using for our lab. We'll be back again next time to talk about another one of our lab simulators. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.